Hi, I'm Lee with Stony Creek Farm in Franklin, Tennessee. We have a small sustainable farm on the east side of Franklin and we love to share our farm with the community. For instance, we have a U-Pick garden, we have 20 garden rental plots, and we also have classes on sustainability and homesteading that we share with the community also. So let's get going and we'll show you the U-Pick garden. This is the beginning of our U-Pick garden where we have grape vines that come in in the fall, but we also have a ton of blueberry bushes. So people are able to come and pick, do you pick or pick your own blueberries and blackberries. And we'll be showing you the blackberries here in just a moment. We've got these on one side of the farm. And then we also, on this side of the barn, we actually have 14 varieties of herbs. Not just your regular herbs, but some that you may not have seen before, like Thai basil that is wonderful in Thai food. Um, and other dishes, and then also sweet basil, Genovese, uh, sage, mint, just a ton of wonderful fragrant herbs that you can pick from here at the farm. So what else is in our you pick garden? Well, we have lots of corn. Yes, and <clears throat> we're one of the few growers that grows non-GMO corn. So, and we're very proud of that. It's delicious, but it's not genetically modified. We also have little signs around the farm that welcome kids <clears throat> and give them the picture opportunity. Uh, one of our sayings here at the farm is be dirt rich because we wrote a book about our sustainable life here on the farm. So we have lots of corn and you can see it's almost ready. The rain we had the other night really helped a lot. But as we're going across, we want you to see more than just corn because we have almost an acre full of you pick garden that you can see it up and come and pick on your own. We have green beans. We have five different varieties of tomato plants that you can pick. We also, as you can see, grow buckwheat in between our tomato plants to attract beneficial insects. The buckwheat, the flowers, are what attracts the beneficial insects. We also have San Marzano Roma tomatoes, and we have four varieties of peppers, not only bell peppers, but we've got all different types, hot and mild. And then we also have uh, an heirloom tomato, which is a Bradley. And then we also grow lots of flowers in the garden that people can come and pick at, and make beautiful bouquets along with Believe it or not, they put herbs with it, so they will have a fragrant bouquet, not only with flowers, but also with uh, all of that. So also, uh, we have several different tomato plants, as you can see, and even more flowers. This beautiful orange flower that I have never heard of before is called Tithonia and it is also a Mexican sunflower. And they grow huge, as you can see. They're very, very large. We also have sunflowers that we grow right beside, and you can see some of those. A lot of them have already been picked. And then we have purple hull peas, <clears throat> which you can see right here that are almost ready. Then we also have more green beans, cucumbers that are trellised, and then lots of squash, zucchini, white scallop squash, and okra in the background. So this is just, these are the items that we let families come and pick and see where their food comes from and have fresh food with no pesticides. Hi, this is Lee and Olin with Stony Creek Farm in Franklin, Tennessee. We just wanted to mention to you how proud we are to be a part of the Pick Tennessee organization. Pick Tennessee has done so much for our farm in promoting us across the state. And we just can't say enough good things about it. We sponsor for the Williamson County Fair, the Pick Tennessee booth. And it has just done a tremendous amount, hasn't it, Owen? Yes, it has done a great amount for us. And I'm sure it's done a great amount for other farms that are listed on the Pick Tennessee site. It's a great resource for people to be able to find produce, livestock, milk, just anything that they happen to be looking for by going to the Pick Tennessee site. 
and it's not just for you pick farms like ours. It's for all types of farms, restaurants, anything that's local just here in our state in Tennessee. It lists all of those. And we love sponsoring the booth at the Williamson County Fair because every year we get to show them all the products from Tennessee. And also we get to show them what we do and get to sign them up for our email list and things like that that really help promote local agriculture. We can't say enough good things about it. So thank you again, Williamson County Fair, for allowing us to sponsor the Pick Tennessee booth. Yes, and we, we know we're living in a different time this year, but the fair will be back live, we hope, in 2020 or 2021. And so we thank the Williamson County Fair for allowing us to sponsor the Pick Tennessee booth. And we look forward to doing it for many more years to come many years. We love it. Thank you.